welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a little while. Did you miss me? Look at what I finally got my hands on. I'm super excited about this. As you can tell from the title, it is the T5 magnifier. I've been wanting this for a while. I'm excited to show you. So let's see what comes in the box here. We have our magnifier. The user guide for those of you like me that like to read. We have the cleaning cloth and adjustment tool. And a really cool little sales paper comes in the box. And this for those of you that like to collect these. Let's get it out of the bag here, see what we got. Look at how pretty that is. So now that I have them out of the boxes, let's look at the differences. Um, they do have the same mount. As you can see, this is sticking out a little further than this one. So I'm gonna make some adjustments on my reel so that I can move this forward and it will sit in the same spot as this does on my rifle. Um, there's a slight weight difference, so this weighs about three ounces more than this one. I personally really can't tell holding it in my hand. Looking through this one, I am starting to like this more, but that might change once I get on behind my rifle. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and mount these and then we'll see how they think. Hey guys, I'm back from the range and I have little Elsa joining me from the inside. Um, so we did go ahead and move this forward so it would sit about the same spot on my railing as this one. Um, I did want to show you the height difference real quick on this. There you go. So you can kind of see how much longer it is and shorter depending on which one you want to buy. They do operate the same way as far as adjusting here where you can kind of move it out of the way if you don't want to use it for a hot second. Um, now, when I was first researching getting this one, people always told me that I might not need it because it might be too much magnification. And I didn't quite understand what that meant. So I wanted to experience it for myself. So to explain, if you're shooting at 150 yards or less, these two actually look a lot of the same. I didn't quite see that much difference, but when I started looking out further than 150, this became much more clear, but there is something that you should know when you're doing that is your field of vision becomes smaller. So depending on what you're wanting in your experience is which one is right for you. Personally, I think they're both very great products. I really like this, so I went ahead and purchased it. Now, if there's anything that I didn't answer for you in this video, please hit me up in the comments. I am going to continue shooting with this, so my first impressions and thoughts may expand as I play around with it. So hit the like and subscribe button so um, you'll see my other videos that I have coming shortly. And I really hope that this video helped you. Have a good day.